In this video, I'm going to talk about how these books differ from the previous Galore Park mathematics textbooks. Well, firstly, there is a new scheme of work, a new syllabus. Although it might not look as first as if there is a big difference, there's not a fundamental change in the topics. However, there is a fundamental change in the examination. In the questions now are going to have less scaffolding, that's less structured questions A, B, C, D that lead the pupils through the solution, much more of posing a problem and then the pupils have to construct their own answers. So in this book, when you get to the problem solving exercises, these also reflect the lack of scaffolding, enabling the pupils to structure their own answers right from the beginning. There are some new topics. There is the topic of proof, which is new, and you'll find both geometrical proof and algebraic proof in these books, again at a level which the pupils can understand, which covers the topics that they know and allows them to use their knowledge to construct these proofs. So that is new. Another thing that's very new is actually really working hard on enlivening the text. That's bringing in cross-curricular topics. You will find green boxes, which do the cross-curricular topics, introducing maybe geography or history or English language. There are um, brown boxes, which talk about the beauty of mathematics, looking at how mathematics helps make our world more beautiful, very much dealing with spiritual elements, as well as that purity, which makes true mathematicians really love their subject. There are investigations, blue boxes. There are projects, gold boxes, particularly looking at environmental projects to engage your pupils' understanding of the world about them and also allowing them to follow up topics that they are interested in. A lot of your pupils will go on to be environmental scientists. That love of that investigation will be embedded in your classroom. There are also social, cultural, environmental and empathy boxes. Empathy is how ISEB have translated the word spiritual from the school regulations. So looking at how mathematics can embrace the empathy between mankind and also between man and nature. In addition, these books are designed to be even more helpful to teachers. There are still the careful explanations, the clearly worked examples, the writing of the digits in the squares reflecting how a pupil's exercise book will look. But we have boosted the material available to teachers in the teacher's guides. In addition to answers and more detailed explanations, there are also assessment sheets where you can record through your pupils whether they've understood those national curriculum topics at Key Stage 3. In addition, also, there are sample schemes of work, depending on whether you are going to follow the book using core maths and additional maths together, or perhaps using core maths in Year 7 and additional maths in Year 8. So these are only examples, but hopefully it will empower you to think what works best for your pupils in your school, and hopefully you will find them useful and informative.